All right, guys, I have a confession to make. I really, really hated selling, okay? It was one of those things, you know, me specifically as an introvert, wasn't something that I thought I was, I was uh, very good at, was, you know, cut out for all that sorts of thing. But because of, because I did it, because I took action, because I learned how to do it, uh, I became very, very good at it and, you know, turned that, that uh, uh, weakness into a strength, okay? So one of the things that I've, I found is, you know, the whole sales environment has changed now, okay? Um, and a lot of the books that you may be familiar with, you know, even going back to like Brian Tracy and stuff like that not too long ago, is very kind of like hard sell approach, just like kind of using tricks and like, you know, certain, certain you know, closes to get people to say yes a bunch of times. And, you know, while there is a place for that, um, there's a whole new world of selling, okay? And the new world of selling is soft selling. And when I first started to understand this, it was the first kind of selling that really resonated with me. And, you know, I think this works really well with the method that we have online here that we're teaching because it, it really communicates, um, you know, more of a conversational selling. Okay, soft selling is more conversational selling rather than the hard, you know, getting someone to buy and, and you know, that sort of thing. And it works well because one, that's, you know, the direction that, that you know, the social community goes in. But two, you know, we're, we're just kind of past that point where, you know, you're, you're kind of trying to trick someone into, into a sale. You know, you want to be able to use conversational sale, sell, selling skills. Um, and, you know, that's what's going to make the magic happen. But there are some things that you need to know. Like when you ask a question, you know, a closing question, you know, you shut up and you let the other person talk. So when you're typing that, you know, if, if, if you're doing this before getting someone on, on the phone, this could be closing them to get them on the phone. Um, you just don't say anything else, right? And if they don't respond, you'll do a question mark or, or uh, just a period, you know, just so you come back to the top of their, of their, um, their message box. So if you are struggling with kind of what to say and, you know, how to kind of communicate with people in a social world, then I really highly recommend this book. Okay, it's called Soft Sell, and the cover is actually the right way in real life. Um, that's because this this uh, video is is uh, reversed, um, and maybe I'll maybe I'll try to fix that. But Soft Sell, this book, um, really changed things for me. And the reason that I'm you know saying this is just simply because you know if you want to do this method and you're just kind of struggling with you know you've got through the videos and you're trying to put into practice you're still kind of struggling with the mentality with the psychology of it all this is the book that will help you do that okay so psychology has always been you know uh, an interesting subject to me uh, something that I've been you know passionate about interested in and this really goes into the psychology of selling so if you're one of those people that wants to know like why and, and understand the why, and then you, it, it, it enables you to, to implement it better, this is the book for you, okay? Um, so, you know, no matter what kind of selling that you're doing, this is a phenomenal, phenomenal book. So I just wanna put that out there for the people that are, you know, looking for, you know, more, more, uh, you know, of the conceptual, of the psychological idea of how to connect with people, because understanding the psychology helps you connect with people, right? That's, that's what you're gonna learn in this book and it's really phenomenal. So I hope this tip is helpful and you know, um, by all means, you know, if this is calling to you, put it into action, you know, get yourself a copy at, at uh, Amazon or, or at the local library or whatever and uh, you know, put it into use and then start implementing. That's the way to do it. All right, thanks guys.